Hip-Hop Radio. Welcome to the Artist Hour, everybody. Uh, we are here with uh, a special band from the Austin area, correct? Yeah. Austin area. Uh, Bert and Meg, so welcome to the show, everybody. What's up? How are y'all doing? Uh, pretty good. Hell yeah. We're doing pretty good. Welcome. So this is our first interview? Yeah. How does it feel to be in front of cameras and microphones and yeah, such? Just, I'm not going to lie. I was chilling before, but now like the camera's on, I'm like, <laughs> Hello. bro, like, my heart's kind of like, oh, you got to like, yeah, yeah, talk. Like, <laughs> yeah. But yeah, we try to make it as, as chill as possible, but uh, welcome welcome to the show. Um, we saw y'all on uh, at the Independence Brewery show. Yeah. yeah. Um, that was our first time even like hearing of y'all and y'all fucking killed it. Yeah. It was I just... fantastic. Um, we're blown away. I got knocked down during y'all set. I wasn't even expecting that. I was just recording y'all, and then out of nowhere, I just got blasted on. scary but y'all fucking killed it your vocals are amazing the drumming is phenomenal this man is an avid drum enjoyer so seeing y'all was fucking crazy i was like what the fuck like the sound that y'all have is fucking like a razor blade that shit is crazy it's like like fucking on some jazz shit Mm -hmm. it really is like the fucking timing and shit it's really fucking it's like it's, it's like, like a well-oiled point. machine. That shit sounds crazy. Like, I've do y'all have recordings any, any shit out yet? No, nah, we don't. I to, felt like I'd known these songs. I was like, holy fuck! I couldn't. I can kind of tell, like, oh, if you're playing sloppy, improvising, whatever the fuck, y'all were like, like I said, like a fucking, a fucking well-oiled machine. That shit was crazy. And it, it was like very impressive. And I was like, yeah, I, I had reached out to you after the show. That's when I met you. Mm-hmm. And I was like, we would love to have you on because like y'all, y'all are like impressive as fuck. And like, how long have y'all been? Yeah. Um, doing this for a year? A, no, not a year. Like almost, it'll Less be like a year, year in like what May? Um, It'd be like a year in May. Um, yeah, yeah, like playing shows though. That's wild. Like, um, and y'all like have been playing like pretty sure like how many shows have y'all played? I don't even know. Like probably like mm. like twenty shows. Lost count. Like twenty. Like fi- I think I don't know. Damn. That's what's up. Like fifteen. I don't know. So how did y'all meet? Like how did this band come together? <laughs> <laughs> The Graham, bro. The Graham. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bro. A, a friend of his that I was friends with, I didn't know who Moses was. They reached out to me and was like, hey, there's a cool drummer. Yeah, and we were going to start, like, we had, like, two or, or three failed bands before this mm-hmm. until we thought it was just good for just us two, maybe doing random shit. Uh-huh. But, um, yeah, his friend, Zoe Zombie, uh <laughs> texted me and was just like hey i got this like drummer guitarist guy he's like he's good at everything i don't know he came, <laughs> like he just came to like jam with us in my hot ass garage at the time <laughs> and i think that's when we just started meeting more i don't know yeah so y'all had like so it was like a four-piece band like they all tried to do or was it like like <laughs> y'all want to get into that <laughs> it's, it's more like what's it called my friend, like, she told me about this one band, and I was like, okay, I'm going I'm to just show up with my stuff and just, like, because mm-hmm. whatever happens, happens. You know, I just want to be, like, playing with somebody. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. you just want to be doing something. Yeah, because I was just playing so long in my room by myself, so I'm uh-huh. like, all right. He's but, too um, good. When yeah, he came, I was like, oh, fuck, I fucking suck. <laughs> 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 uh, it, was, it was cool. Uh, and then I was like, okay. I was playing my bass, and, like, I was like, okay, this is this is pretty fun, but I, I liked playing the guitar. Mm-hmm. For, and I was like, okay. Like maybe if I hop on drums, we can do like something. Cause you need to have like a drummer, you yeah. know, like a really good drummer. So. Very important. So I'm like, yeah, let me just yes. try. And I was like, I was playing drums like in my garage, like mm-hmm. just figuring it out. Like, mm-hmm. All right, let me see. So, yeah. So you, so you were you were originally a guitarist then? Yeah, and that's then you how to play drums. I started playing bass, and yeah, I was. I, I play guitar too, and that's the exact same way. I had a drum set. I was terrible at it, and then I got a guitar, and I got really good at the guitar, and then went back to the drums, and the drums came so mm-hmm. fucking naturally. Yeah. So, yeah. So how how long have you? Well, how long were you like as far as like your musical, um, like what made you like start like one? Oh, I'm gonna play guitar. I'm gonna do this. It goes for both y'all. Yeah. What made you interested like, in music? What age and like yeah, like what like made you? Oh shit, I could I could probably do this. Well, I've been interested in music for a while. Like I I started playing 
my violin in like second grade. Oh, oh damn. Yeah, like I went to this like school there like doing piano and violin. I was like, all right, I wanna do like I wanna do a violin because I wanna play with strings. Oh, yeah. And then I just saw like they had like a whole bunch of instruments in the room. I was like, why can't we play these? Like what is this just sitting here for? Yeah, why yeah. am I restricted? Yeah. 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 So I'll just go over there and like look at all of it and I'm like, okay, I wanna learn how to play guitar one day. So yeah, I played I started playing that second grade and then like sixth grade I started playing cello and then did that like all through like middle school and like fifth grade and like until high school because my high school like stopped offering like they, oh the arts yeah, shit like, the, oh, really? like wow. they're defunding it and shit yeah like, fuck like bro I'm not even having fun anymore because if like no one yeah like, no one wants to even fund us why am I gonna do it you know mm-hmm. but still I, I enjoyed it but yeah that is wild. Damn, I didn't. I didn't even know that was that was a thing. That there's like defunding shit. Like oh that. yeah. Is yeah. that like all schools or just like? I don't know. I, th- I feel you, like if I've been at school way too long. <laughs> I think I'll, whenever I went to Austin for a little bit, I was excited because the next year I could have been able to try uh, jazz band, mm-hmm. and uh, fucking we moved and we came over here. Damn, got that shit. Mm. I was fucking pissed. Right. I wanted to play drums so bad. Right. Jazz band. That's crazy. What about you? As far as um, like like what made you like want? Oh shit, I could I could do this. I could play uh-huh. these instruments and whatnot. Uh, I, when I was. And like for <laughs> when I was first starting out uh-huh. with a uh, guitar, it was probably in like end of middle school. I was like such a big fan of Joan Jett. Um, Fire. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, might go see her maybe because she's coming to Austin. Oh, but yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, it was just uh, I don't know. Just listening like all these girl bands. I don't really like write girl bands that much, but some of them are like okay mm-hmm. and just like listening to those i was just like and eh, maybe i'll hop on and uh our first failed band uh was kind of it sounded like a riot girl band uh-huh so uh, but i kind of wanted more like hardcore shit yeah yeah and which is definitely what y'all sound like yeah, y'all yeah. Sound <laughs> sick uh and it's just that i don't know um so like you you just picked up the guitar and it was kind of like it's kind of like natural yeah. to you or yeah i used <laughs> I guess yeah. I uh, just picked it up and I was just like, okay, I'll just learn it. And it was, it was off and on. And then I just got more into it during like sophomore year of high school. Mm-hmm. Uh, Damn, that's that's bad. That's badass. And like yeah. the fact that like, so how long like has it been since you like have been playing like guitar and shit like that like together as far as like years was? Oh. Because like you said, the you had a couple bands before that, but like yeah, how long like, have y'all like been a musical like? group like duo it's like october 2022 i think okay and that's when y'all started like playing yeah, we, play, like, like practicing like, together yeah, and stuff like just that hanging out and mm-hmm. just jamming yeah and as far as the vocal aspect like I, that's like like <laughs> yeah I, like what are you like what are your like, influences like on like like how y'all sound like vocally as well mm-hmm. like because because you you sounded crazy yeah. like in the best way possible I, yeah like, okay. i was like holy shit like this is wild um another tangent real quick like not tangent but like Y'all sound like a full like yes. Four that's why in band. That's why yes. we're so impressed. I was fucking freaking out. Y'all. I was looking for more people. I was like, "There's somebody on the side stage that has to be." Like, <laughs> yeah, and I was like, "What the yeah. fuck?" There's only two of y'all. But like, yeah. So as far as the vocal aspect, like, what, like, what, as far as the influence, like, like, how, how, like, what made you like want to like sound like do that vocal? Gulch, a lot, a lot of Gulch. I really okay. love Gulch's like just the vocalist is crazy, and um like this man can scream like pretty high mm-hmm. i don't know i thought it was a girl at first when i first listened to gulch in middle school mm-hmm. but um yeah i would i was like listening to that and i was like okay i, I fuck with it i want to do mm-hmm. this i can't go low with my vocals yeah uh. <laughs> i can't go low with my vocals at all um so i just decided like i want to have vocals where it sounds like your ears are bleeding, but in a good way. Yes. Like, uh, something well, like that. Well, <laughs> executed. Yeah. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, that, I, I was like, again, like that, the way it all sound is like so full and like, y'all yeah, have volume to just two people like in a band. And so like, it like, it surprised the fuck out of us. I'm like, okay, we got to get him on because. Yeah. How many songs do y'all have written? Bro. Uh, written like. 12. Yeah, like a 12 songs. 12 songs, yeah. I, l- I think our setup is like nine songs, yeah. but they're short. Like, yes. Yeah, Two, four, like six songs with like little in betweens, like interludes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Damn. So like, have y'all y'all have y'all like in the studio at all or? No, mm-hmm. we just in my room. Pumps it up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sometimes I like I rec- like I put the mic up to the like to my fucking like two yeah. two channel mixer, yeah. you know, like, mm-hmm. just to, like record guitar. Sometimes, but 
other than that, not, not really. Do y'all, do y'all think that, are y'all ready to do, like, studio recordings and, like, stuff like that? Yeah, is that, like, something, or is that something trying to get that you're not prioritizing Yeah, right we're, just, we're just broke. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I key, Real? High key. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't know, I kind of want to, like, learn how to self-produce, but, like. Yeah, which I think y'all should definitely do. Y'all sound is fucking great. Right. I don't think you need much, like, help with, like, the production side of shit. I feel like y'all need to really sound raw, because the shit I heard there was, like, holy fucking shit. Like, because we, we've, we've got a plenty of shows, and we, like, there's people that, like, like they're like okay they're cool like but they sound like everybody else but y'all don't so we are very nostalgia pod we want to talk about um want to get to know y'all a little more as well so whenever y'all were like growing up like what like what what were y'all like into as far as like movies or like 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 what was like something that you were like addicted to like watching or like listening to or something like that what's your favorite shit yeah favorite shit yeah. basically we just want to know yeah. everyone's favorite shit <laughs> older like technology and stuff like analog uh, stuff mm-hmm. like silver like in the 70s like the silver face like back panel like wooden back panel and shit mm-hmm. like oh, i yeah, love yeah. shit like that like older analog shit and i want to like have all like the analog things like recording on tape uh-huh. and being like so mechanical with it oh that's but, sick. Like, yeah it's really like it just costs too much like oh yeah right now bro because it's yeah. so easy to do this shit with like digital oh, stuff yeah they don't make analog shit no more <laughs> right like this is like thousands of dollars it's like it's mm. not worth it though i like, really like old shit like vintage like furniture like crazy okay. architecture and stuff mm-hmm. like as far as like like do you have like vhs tapes and stuff that you collect yeah yeah that's like, the shit i haven't been up on that but i can said like i collect cassettes oh okay. oh hell yeah so yeah I, like part of like I don't know, I'm like, I find myself like, cause since I, I came up on like a, a VCR and a DVD player, like mm-hmm. mixed in one. And so I started like collecting hella like VHS tapes and stuff like that. I'm like collecting all the movies I would watch as a kid. Yeah, we we do that. I, I, I'm a hoarder with fucking posters. I love posters. It's If I find a poster that I like, I, it's hard for me not to get it. And then I don't even put it up. I have by my bed probably, I'm not fucking, probably 30 posters that I don't want to put up yet. Like, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we're we're just collectors. We'd be collecting shit, and like as far as like like movie wise, like what what were you like? What was like something that you would be like watching? Like what's like movie that you think about like as a kid? Like oh I shit, I'm seeing this like for the millionth time. It's have you ever seen like this is old at like dude like the there's this movie called The Big W, and it's like I think it's like it. no like. It looks like 1960s, 1970s, 1980s movie. Mm-hmm. That's a big ass uh-huh. decade. That's a big, that's a big <laughs> but like it's, that happens it's, over it's there. Like, it's, <laughs> it's like way before like, and it's just like this. I don't know. It's like a whole bunch of like average folk, like like nuclear family shit. Okay. And then they find like money, like they know where, like they find a jackpot for money. So everyone's just gunning for the money. Uh-huh. And then they're all like meeting up, and like it cuts to people, and it looks it's it's pretty cool and like. It's really old. <laughs> like, Damn, that, I, I don't so like, remember it. Do you like? Did you even understand like the concept like back then when you like watch it as a kid? Yeah, like, yeah. I was like, bro, they're you just want that. they're crazy. money hungry. Like, <laughs> yeah. they, they don't. They bought their money. Like, <laughs> yeah, showing like their struggles. So I was like, okay, they uh, they trying to get out of their struggles. Uh, what about you? What were you? Into? Movies. Yeah, as yeah. far as movie wise, like something that like one movie that you're like, oh shit, I've seen this a million times. Like as a kid. Scott Pilgrim. <laughs> God, <damn. laughs> okay, fuck yeah. yeah. Real, I fucking love that movie. <laughs> Is that like one movie that you can like watch like over and over again? Oh yeah, I, I am um, trying to collect all the books still, but I'm always like tired to go out and mm. go to a bookstore. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know, but yeah, I could talk about Scott Pilgrim <laughs> all day. Man. Did you see the uh, the animated? Yeah. Did, did that come out yet? Yeah. They Is were, it good or no? It's some people have like different like feelings about it like every time i like talk about mm-hmm. it someone will be like oh, oh i don't like it it's, not <laughs> it's that either good. love or hate it's not like yeah it is um, it like the movie just like in a show form or like i'm so confused about um, like what it is they were supposed to instead of the movie because it was filmed in like 2006 five mm-hmm. uh instead of that they were gonna make that in like into an anime before like the live action oh yeah yeah, yeah. and so yeah. and it's like i guess all the like stories in those like what live action anime and the comics Mm -hmm. um there's like different like fucking stories so like the anime is like uh the version where scott doesn't win and gets kidnapped oh Oh, shit what the fuck Fuck. i don't even know anything about that yeah (laughs) Yeah. and then uh the comic i guess it's it's just like normal i don't know Mm -hmm. but yeah did you uh so like 
What happened? Okay, I kind of want to know about it now. <laughs> can you like, can you like, can you like talk about that real quick? Like, what do you mean kidnap? I'm so confused because I've only seen the movie. His older self comes to kidnap him to stop like dating Ramona. What the fuck? Yeah. I didn't know it was all like that. Because he's like, oh, Ramona ruined my life. He's like, I don't know. And um, he was seems he seemed pretty yourself. stressed out. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't blame him. <laughs> that shit's wild. Uh-huh. Um, okay, so now we have an, another kind of hard one. So like, whenever you were um. Like, say, like, you're in the backseat of your parents' car, just, like, hanging out, just, like, whatever. Like, you're being a kid, and, like, you, you, um, and something's on the radio, or, like, they have a, a CD player, or a CD, like, something's playing. Like, as far as, like, what were they, what were you, like, put on to as a kid? Like, from my parents? Yeah. yeah. What are they, what were your parents listening to? That was, like, the longest Yeah, that was crazy. Ever. I was like, wow, this is... Yeah. Little stone, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Uh, my mom was just playing a lot of gospel music. <laughs> she's, like, she's real. Okay. She's... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. She's playing a lot of gospel music, and like the only thing she would play was like Bob Marley. So I was oh, just like yeah, listening to that right. shit Not over and over thing. and over yeah. again. So I love that so much. But like, yeah, that's what my mom was playing. It's mm. a lot of gospel. Good music. Damn, that's a lot badass. Of gospel. Hey, hey, that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> Praise the Lord. <laughs> Praise the Lord for real. <laughs> <laughs> what about you? Uh, my mom was like into fuck just SPM. And oh, shit. Cool. Yeah. And she cool? was like, I don't, her music taste, That's her music crazy. genre was like fucking everywhere. Exactly. So she would put like Tool and Deftones and SPM on and then some like country shit. Oh, I got all into that. Nice. But like I was like with her metal taste, I was like, I need something a little more harder. Like yeah. it doesn't describe what's going on. Nah, me too. Uh, My dad showed me like hair metal and shit. And I was like, I need like fucking thrash i need something yeah. like harder than this and it's like drugs you just find it hard then you find hardcore <laughs> and then you find like, experimental fucking noise music it's just yeah. fucking white noise shit's fire hell yeah nah i get that though <laughs> my, my fucking friend's dad my dad his dad put me on spm and all that stuff <laughs> damn he was he was really cool had that influence of like rap and not like really that much like hardcore music mm-hmm. or like any like metal you know so what was y'all's first time like hearing like a like I guess hardcore as like the sound like the first band of like oh fuck I like this of, of, of hardcore yeah or, like, like just yeah. like the subject of like metal and like rock and general shit both fuck it yeah, yeah, bro, yeah. honestly the first time yeah. you heard like some distorted ass guitar then the, what's the first time yeah. you heard like dude my friend put me on Green Day bro and like okay like yeah. fourth grade bro uh-huh. I was like alright bet this is this is kind of it's kind of real a mm-hmm. bit enticing mm-hmm. you know. So I was listening to, like, clean rap and shit before that. <laughs> bro, I was, like, so much, like, in third grade, like, Big Sean and, like, uh-huh. that shit, was, like, playing on the radio, bro. Like, that was the only thing going on, like, Drake, bro. Like, I was yeah. so, like, ugh, Like, mainstream, radio super filled, mainstream, bro. yeah. Yeah. But, like, yeah. Until Green Day? Yeah, to, like, Green Day. And then after that, it was just, like, I met my, my friend in, like, seventh grade, and he played like thrash metal on the guitar mm-hmm. and I was playing guitar and I was like dude he's just like so much better than me bro and yeah like, thrash is yeah I need to learn this and like we started playing like Slayer together in, like a practice room uh-huh. and just sick. grinding it out hell yeah yeah that's badass that was bad. what about you um what was the question like your first <laughs> time hearing like I guess he said like rock music metal music and then like hardcore as well uh, with like metal music I think 7th grade 6th grade I don't know um the Black Delilah Murderer, um, Kings and Night World, just that mm-hmm. one song. That's the only fucking song. And then I got into Gulch, and then I guess it just started like like that. But I mm-hmm. used to listen to like terrible punk, old punk music nah, before that's, that. Like who? Like Screeching Weasel. They're not terrible, but they're they're, uh-huh. they're good. <laughs> I don't know. I just started like listening to that, and then just like basic like popular punk mm-hmm. bands. Damn. Yeah, that that that's that's it's kind of like the same like way that we kind of like grew up because we we started with like like my mom playing like like hair metal and hair shit metal, like that yeah. and like all that and then like occasional Metallica <laughs> and you're like oh this is cool what is this and then like my brother he's like six years older than me so he was like listening to like all this like like cooler shit before I was his brother's so. the coolest person in the world he, he's like every like every cool big brother wishes they were Marshall yeah for real and like so he like he got into like like job for a cowboy like all these like crazy ass like. Like, uh, Born of Osiris, like, all this yeah. crazy shit. I'm like, oh, this is fucking sick. And then he got into, like, Odd Future. And then, like, he had every phase that he had, I had, too. And so, like, like it's so... So put you yeah. on, bro. But now I have, like, we're at this, like, age now, like, where you have, like, all these different, like, musical influences. Like, I can listen to country, like, Tejano music, punk, and, like, all this shit in, like, one day. Yeah. And, like, 
I just want to know like like what is y'all's daily rotation as far as like, like music, music mix like anything Dude. everything Sometimes it changes like I have this I listen to a lot of ambient music mm-hmm. like ambient guitar because it's so like if you just have a whole bunch of pedals you can make anything like yeah. sound super good and like in that ethereal feeling you know mm-hmm. but I, I was really into, I'm really into that like right now like shoegaze like obviously mm-hmm. but then like on the other hand I'm like listening to like there's this band in fucking I think New York or like somewhere in the east coast it's called Gasket bro and they're like they're pretty they're pretty new and they're I like them a mm-hmm. lot and it's, it's hard some n- nice hardcore music cause I don't know oh yeah like, just hearing it like I wasn't even like conscious of like the scene like before like two years ago or three years ago mm-hmm. I was like okay I, I just want to get into music and like I didn't I didn't know any bands so I was like signing yeah. up on shit and like I'd get an ad on like Instagram like musicians wanted like knowing yeah. that shit is not gonna go anywhere yeah. bro uh-huh. but then like getting involved yeah. into like like seeing other people play I was like damn okay mm-hmm. I need to see this and get more involved into it and talk to people hell yeah, yeah. And the tap in was like like to start meeting people and yeah. shit like that yeah bro that's, like, like, that's all you do that's all you need to do really is just like like show up and show love to like shows and shit yeah, like that bro, and I'm like see like, even if you yeah. don't like all the bands that are there like keep no doing just, it you're like, about, you're about to find it, something that's fucking right really, honestly that's how I feel went to that show I didn't know who y'all were and I was like what the fuck is this like <laughs> that shit fucked me up it really did it was wild shout out Lid too I, I was I, I was like I didn't, I didn't know them either, and I was like, oh shit, this is fucking sick. Mm-hmm. Like, it reminded me of, like, being, like, 13, listening to my, my brother listen to music in, like, a, the best way possible. Yeah, yeah. Like, it, it took me back, and also, like, they sound new at the same time. Like, damn, like, shout out Lid, they're cool as fuck. Yeah. Um, but as far as you, um, damn, what did I ask? I forgot already. <laughs> oh, oh, but daily rotation, like, what, like, what, like, how is, like, a daily, like, music rotation go for you? Oh, fuck. Or, like, who are you into, like, musically, like, oh. now? Oh, I got this question. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Again, and Gulch, and mm. then I'm such a big fan of Crystal Castles. Not in that, like, oh my god. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's so aesthetic. You fuck with Alice Glass. Yeah, yeah, you fuck with it. Yeah. Um, Alice Glass, amazing vocalist. I love, I kind of love her, her solo stuff. Yeah, it's but, a little, little yeah. crazy sometimes. Mm. And then um, her, like, screaming in Crystal Castles is, like, perfect. Cherry on top to mm. Ethan Katz. Fuck that bitch. Yeah, um, stuff. Us. And then, but... I really, really love Edith Francis, the second vocalist. She's my inspo when I play live too. Oh, no. So, um, the second vocalist uh, in Crystal Castles. Yeah. Oh, really? I didn't even know that. On the last album in 2016. Oh uh, shit. Yeah. Um, but then uh, Alice Glass posted that stuff. Yeah, and, yeah. Yeah. Controversial band, but really legendary. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So. It's, it's it's hard to like separate the art from the artist, like because yeah. like. Obviously, like they made like the best fucking music together, but he's yeah. also a horrible person. So, it fucking it fucking sucks, and I hate that that happened. But like, it's so hard not to listen yeah. to like kerosene, like all that. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So, like, their first two albums are fucking phenomenal. Like, so it sucks, but I, her her solo shit's pretty fucking good too. And there's like, but some of them are like, I'm kind of like, they kind of scare me. <laughs> 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 so like a little interesting, and I'm like, I don't hate it, but like, damn, what the hell. Uh, oh going back to what you were saying about um like pulling up the shows and stuff like that like what was the first like local show that y'all like had went to oh that was pretty recent oh really not recent but like within the last year or something Mm -hmm. oh shit you're good Um, (laughs) like within the last year or two yeah (laughs) Yeah. you're good but i don't know i saw my friend told me to pull up the friend that the same friend Zoe that put me on with Anna, she was like, "All right, pull up to the show." Mm-hmm. So I was telling her that that day, I was like, "I really want to get into like shoegaze music." And then she's like, "Oh, there's a shoegaze band playing here." I was like, "All right, pit." Where was that? <laughs> it was at the tunnels at like, I think September or something. It was like pale fading and they're mm-hmm. playing over there. And I was like, "Okay, let me see." And then I was like, "Damn, that's pretty good," because they're just out here doing that, and mm-hmm. like I didn't even know about them. Like they're then they're from here. I was like, "Okay." Oh, yeah. They put me on to like, okay, they're, they're these people are from San Antonio. Okay, these are people from Austin. They like they can play, they meet each other and play shows. And mm-hmm. like, yeah, that's pretty cool. Damn, you put this a bit. Is that was that your first show too? Like like globally or no? Uh, it was it was with User Unauthorized on the lineup, okay. Subverter, um, Fascist Peach Cobbler, mm-hmm. and this owned I think it was at the tunnels. I don't I don't remember how long that was. It was like. 
freshman year for me probably. Oh shit. I don't know. Four or five years ago. So who's like, so like y'all are co- y'all are meeting up with these people at the at these shows, other bands and stuff like that, and y'all are building like a a, a name for yourselves. Um, as far as like this year, like what like what's like a like a, what's like a goal? Like do y'all want to do like play like as far as like playing with ba- like different bands or like different cities even. Like, I don't know. I've never. I've really never really thought about that. Like playing out. We've played like one time at like in like San Antonio like a while back, but like mm-hmm. I never really thought about like going out of state or like. About. I just want to be able to play somewhere. You yeah. just want to do like, like you know, more shows. Yeah, I just want to do more. Sh- like even like even if I don't know you, you know, I'll yeah. just play, play shows with you. But I don't know. Asking people for I feel kind of like scared though because I'm like, damn, they're so good. And I'm like, okay, <laughs> no, I, don't, I don't. I'm like, y'all are. Fucking I feel like great. a little kid sometimes. Yeah, for, nah, for sure, y'all are fucking. Well, great you know, does it? Does you think that it's part of because like y'all are kind of like a newer band? Is that yeah, why? Yeah, yeah, literally. Yeah, no, nah, but y'all are the shit for real. Yeah, y'all I feel sound like, fucking great. Yeah, I feel like y'all have like. As, as like young as y'all's band is, like like y'all sound like y'all been doing this shit for like three years. Yeah, like I said, that the material really sounded bad. like. Preach. Like I said, yeah. I didn't know it, but it was like, oh, they're they're not messing up right now. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, sounded great. Fuck. Dream like lineup for like the local scene. Like what? Like who? Like what's like a good lineup that you like? Oh shit, I love all these people. Like, that's probably who was probably hard. Like what is like local scene like Austin only like Austin or like, or like San Antonio yeah, I guess like, like yeah. as far as like, like, like what like what's like a good lineup that like y'all just, like oh shit we're about to tear this shit up or just anybody <laughs> we'll do both we'll do both yeah, we'll do both okay. start with the local and then we'll do the anybody. local okay I'm like okay I really I really want to see Sanity Slip like I hear their music I'm like, I'm like okay they yeah. they got it bro yeah. they got it and they went to that heavy hitters fest and I I didn't go bro I was like I stayed at home and I was like bro because I I just couldn't go I was like fuck damn I shouldn't. I keep hearing about them. I've never, I've never heard the heat tell you about them. Bro, I, I, I like them a lot. But Sanity Slip, uh, if I could get, they Bosch, bro. They, they go yeah, hard. Shout out, shout shout out, out Bosch. Bosch. <laughs> shout out Bosch. Like, bro, they're pretty good. They're hella good. They're very <laughs> good. They're like, that's another well-oiled machine right there, too. Right, yeah, they're, they're, they're killing it. They're so groovy, bro. Hell yeah. yeah. Bro. That's like um, a good lineup for you so far? Um, <laughs> bless you, Zach. God bless you, Zach. <laughs> What about you, yeah. as far as lineup wise? Yeah, you, I, I need to add some more. Yeah, yeah I'm like, like, like blanking like right now, bro. Like, in. bro, no way. Like, no <laughs> way. We can come back. Uh, I don't know. Same as his. Mm-hmm. I used to want to be on a lineup with Die Spits, but we sound so far from that. Mm-hmm. But but that was before they got like huge as fuck, like out of nowhere. It was just like bam. Oh, they're verified now. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, yeah, they are yeah. pretty fucking huge now. Yeah. Uh, uh, just the same answer as this. Really, Sanity yeah. slipping a uh, Bosch. Bosch. Yeah, Dude. yeah, Bosch is fucking. There's more, bro. Yeah, yeah. There's more. There's more. <laughs> <laughs> yes, bro. Like, okay, I so swear. dream, dream lineup. Y'all are on the lineup, <laughs> and y- your favorite like group or artist. Like, it could be any genre too. It doesn't even have to yeah. be like the same type. Like, like who, like who do you want to play a show with? Like, okay, like I'm gonna. I have like different lineups for like different genres. Let's hear it. You know, so I'm like, okay, if I want to like, listen to like something more thrashy and like something more fast paced, you know? Mm-hmm. Oh, like there's this band called Kinetic Orbital Blast on fucking, on yeah, bro. Yeah. <laughs> like they're so, I like I like that sound because it's just, it's just raw and it's just fast in your face. I mm-hmm. like that a lot. Mm-hmm. And a fucking gasket. Um, oh my God, Melissa. 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 Yeah, they're pretty good. They're there. good. Yeah. Bro, good. what's it called? Cruelty, bro? It's called Cruelty. I was like, that's I don't know any of these people. I feel fucking, like a loser. Yeah, they're from, they're they're fucking, from Japan. Yeah. Oh, they're yeah. fucking crazy. They went hard. That's sick. Yeah. So that, that, that's who you would have as like a oh. dream like lineup? Or Dude, like, like <laughs> there's so many people, right? Yeah. Give me like five. Oof. That's hard too. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you said like three already. Yeah. There's so much more. Bro, Body Box. Uh, bro. Mm-hmm. Yeah. See, I need to know. Like, I'm so like out of the loop every time. Cause, like, we interviewed like Sexpert the other day too, and they kept on naming all these people, and I'm like, damn, I don't know anybody. <laughs> yeah. Like, I thought I know music, but I don't know shit. It's so crazy. No, I feel that though. I feel that. Like going going to these shows. Like, I've been we've been going to a lot more like local yeah. shows and stuff like that, and like being put on to like local bands, and like he, hearing like who are they influenced by. I'm like, holy shit! Like, there's so much music I do not know about. Yeah. Like, the sky's the limit. Like, I don't know shit. Yeah. And like, I thought like I'm like super. I thought I know something, something. Yeah, but I don't, yeah. It I gets more know. niche, bro. It gets way yeah. more niche. Like, I need to like sit down and like listen to every suggestion, like every people that you have just like suggested today. Like that shit's wild. Mm. Like what? Like so? How did you find out about 
like these like bands like you just like be posted up in your room and like just like yeah bro. like research and shit or no, like so sometimes you be putting me on bro <laughs> <Not> really <laughs> no, bro. any hardcore shit i get from zach zach yeah no, literally bro literally from her bro. and then i'm like and then i go on my own avenue i'm like okay this is what i like this is what i don't like sometimes she likes something i don't like i'm like okay yeah 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 yeah, yeah you don't like hold back you're like oh this shit sucks yeah, yeah. <laughs> there have been times where zach's like this is it i'm like it's not it's not it yeah, i'm like i'm like nah they're just not there yet yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. We're we're still in our infancy, you know. <laughs> but or yeah, we we love like coming out to to local shows like that and stuff like that. And like, see, yeah, seeing y'all was very was very uh like a breath of fresh air. Yeah. And a lot of people probably would feel the same way because, like, the other bands that were on, they were great, they were phenomenal. But like, y'all just had like a different aura. And, yeah. Like, is that something that y'all like even like think about? Um, just like no. y'all, just like what what do y'all think about when you're like on stage? Yeah. I was saying, like, all right, we're going to do our thing. Like, yeah. everybody, they, all the other bands, they're doing their thing. We're on the bill. We're going to do our thing. Like, yeah. That's the way it is. You, you get, you you get somebody, out. yeah, you got to show yeah. out, though. Yeah. Because they're, like, your friends, too, you know, mm-hmm. to put on for your friends. What about you? What are you, what are you feeling when you're up there? Shit. I'm going to throw a water bottle on <laughs> someone's face. <laughs> I'll, I'll just sure. be, like, staring sometimes at people. Damn, this is what people do. Like, mm-hmm. Well, on my free time. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll think about that afterwards. Like, at yeah. home, I'm like, damn. I'm like, damn, I, I should have threw, like, something at someone. We had a room full of people fucking trying to kill each other while I was playing yeah. the game. It's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Like, and I go to school, I'm like, this ain't bad. I'm like, I can't believe that happened. Yeah. yeah. No. Just be, like, uh, dissociating up there. I'll just be like, okay. Okay. And, um, but, like, when we get up there, I'm like, I want, I want my, like, guitar to sound like, like, oh, yeah, like how it did at practice. But sometimes our shit sounds, like, completely different <laughs> like, when we play. Yeah. Yeah. Is that and we're like, like, as oh. far as, like, acoustics in there? Like, the sound? Or? Yeah, yeah. All that stuff. It just sounds, like, so bassy. That's probably why, like, it's just I don't know. It's dialed in, right? Like, I'm, yeah. it's such a gear buff, but, like, and I try to dial everything in, and when it doesn't, put, like, come off right, I'm like, bro. See, bro, and that's, yeah. I've only seen it once, and I can fucking tell, like, like y'all took that shit serious, and as much as, like, like you're saying, gear-wise, like, y'all sounded fucking great. Y'all sounded really fucking good. Thank you. And, um, better. so, like, after after the fact, so now you, you talked about, like, in the moment, but, like, after, like, the sh- you go get off stage, like, how do you feel? Uh, nervous. Like, after? Yeah. Even after? I'm like, oh, who, who's going to come up to me like, next? Fuck, no. <laughs> yeah, like, it, it can be an op. It can be, like, op? someone. Yeah, got, I have bro, ops op? coming at me. You got ops? You have ops? Yes. Oh, I told you. Oh, There's this person oh. I don't want to talk to, and they're just like, Good show, good show. No, oh, so great. No, I'm like, oh no. man, you don't take the clue. I even blocked them too. I was like, damn, you can't take the clue. Yeah. Yeah. Are you shooting out right now? Never to see this too. That's crazy. Leave them all right. Bro. For real. <laughs> right now, damn. <laughs> that's funny as hell. Damn, I didn't know y'all got ops like that. That's crazy. Nah, just oh me. God. I ain't got no ops. Just me. <laughs> <laughs> but at least I think, bro. Yeah. No. He's the peaceful like, one. Bro, I'm just like, all right. You're not. I just gonna play. No, if someone like says something like like Sideways. personal, to, something, Sideways. something, Sideways. something. Sideways, yeah. If someone says something personal to like us, I'll be the one to like comment or like say something. Like, what do you about, mean by that? Like, <laughs> that happened, uh, we before? we had a show set up uh, a while back. It was at. Mm. Oh. Um, bro, you cheated. Yeah, so that's the controversial shit. thing. I'm sorry. <laughs> it was it was all on me. It wasn't that bad. But there was like, just people shit. threatening to break our shit if we showed up there because it's a it's a skate. It's like a secret skate. Yeah, it's like a it's why. Like, yeah. What the we f- airing this out it, though? Yeah. <laughs> like, it's no. an abandoned. It's okay, it's like bro, because like they're skaters and like yeah. they built that shit and like I respect it yeah. though because like it's a DIY. Well, how many chances do you get a DIY before like it gets shut down or something? Yeah, yeah. yeah. that's why we stopped. And it's like Everyone really yeah. Us. It's like pub pub side is publicizing it and it's like yeah. bro, they don't want that obviously because oh. it's like skateboarding is so niche you know oh they're turning into like, i respected like a, that the but heads, they were like threatening us so i was like saying shit back and oh, i was yeah. just like, <laughs> like i don't give a uh, fuck man like, we'll, nah. we'll stop what the fuck? but that sucks because y'all are just trying to play like yeah i was just trying to play but like God damn. And I, I be skating sometimes. I'm like, I don't want to get, yeah. get any skate ops, bro. Yeah. Nah. No, that's him. No. That's funny. That's funny as hell. God damn. damn. So then no, it was like that. Fuck. Yeah, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. I'm trying to no. get. To, I'm trying to get to like to like know about saying, like, this whole community shit. Whole that's community. how it goes. Because like usually like whenever we go, it's like more like I see like overwhelming support. But I didn't know there's like some people that are like messy like that. I didn't. I don't know nobody. Bro, bro. <laughs> Look at you. I don't, know, bro, I don't know nobody, bro. Damn. I'm just be doing my thing. Oh my god. That's wild. 
So, I, but like, but ge- generally, it's mostly a good thing. Good things that people come up and say to y'all. Yeah, yeah. for the most part, yeah. Because I, I guess they're just showing their support. It's like, Only keep if on it's going. personal yeah. stuff, yeah. I'll fucking say yeah. something. <laughs> Um, yeah, that's really, I really appreciate it though, because it's like, bro, I'd be trying, I'd be trying to stay out of the way. Yeah, oh no, just to like, I'd be trying to my like playing drums. It's just like, okay, I need to play this, and then they're like, like, oh, you did so good. I'm like, okay, I, I messed up here, but it didn't really match. So, yeah, you know, I'm yeah. just having fun. You know. So what's like the first show y'all ever played? I was at Tone House. Tone House. Yeah. Oh, it was yeah. a cool line. How'd that go? What's it called? <laughs> it was. <laughs> yeah. We were nervous, like. Bring it because it was so far down. It was like, I think it's somewhere in like Buda or something. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, we went there once. Yeah, yeah. It's like I brought in all the, I don't know the address, but like, yeah. Mm-hmm. We played over there and it was with Pipe and Dean's new band. Mm-hmm. And Stia. And yeah, and Stia. Yeah, and Yeah, it's Stia. Stia. So, so as far as like, <laughs> like sound wise, like, just like the nerves and stuff like that, like, so like, can you like walk me through the process of like how y'all were, were feeling it and going on to the to the stage for the first time ever it was so hot bro oh it was in the summertime yeah bro oh, okay. like bro nah. my garage <laughs> yeah mm. it was so fucking hot but Damn. i was really nervous because like i was setting our, up our shit because i didn't know like you're supposed to just have it like ready so you can just put it out there you're like so uh, everything was still together. in the truck and like, oh, we were just fuck. like running back and forth and I, I left my fucking chair there and shit oh. and like yeah but playing that it was it was really fun because I just had fun up there. And I was yeah. Like, All right, I could just do this. How did you feel like you did on there the, for your first time ever? Pretty bad. Really? <laughs> Why? Like, you beating yourself up about it? Yeah, bit? probably, but like, I don't know. I had fun. I just, I just had a little mm-hmm. fun. Mm-hmm. What about you? How did you feel your first show? Oh. <laughs> uh, it was, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I was just like nervous, but I was like, fuck. Uh, I don't know if we sound terrible or if we sound good, because, mm-hmm. like, I don't know. Um, had y'all had other people, like, sit into, like, practices and stuff and hear y'all before y'all's first show? Or was it, like, just, this is it? I think Zoe? so. Uh, I think so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yeah, you were there. Uh, like, you were, like, you were, you were just, like, you just, like, did just did your thing, like you said, yeah. and just, just yeah. got off. Uh, at, we started as a joke at first. Yeah, oh, really? yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah, we were, why he came up with like the name. Yeah, I was gonna ask about the name. Yeah, yeah. What's, the, yeah. what's the name? It's like, bro? bro, it's like two fucking farmers, bro. Like I thought of like American Gothic, the picture. Uh. Yeah. Like, two fucking, imagine if they were like in a like so in a band, sick, yeah. bro, and they're just like in their garage. Just, dun, dun. Wait, Wait, isn't that South Park episode? It's like, yeah, yeah. But then you're like, I hate this form. I hate this form. And I'm like, bro, what the fuck? Oh, <laughs> That's funny. That'd as be fuck. so funny. So Bert and Meg are like, so like, how, how did like, so you just thought of two names? Yeah, like the two whitest names you could probably think. Of. <laughs> That's Bart right. and Megan. That's funny as hell. So Megan, and I'm not. No, I'm not. Her aliases now. Aliases. So who's who's Bert? Who's Meg? Yeah. Bro. Who's pink? Who's full? random people who's come up to me sometimes? <laughs> hey Meg. They're, yeah. Who, what the, who the fuck? Like, yeah. Who the fuck? This one guy. I went to the spot show. And he was like, so like, you're Bert, right? I was like, yeah. Yeah. I was like, me. Yeah. I was like, no, but my name is Moses. But he like he said later Bert. I was like, all right, bro. Damn. Yeah, like, how do y'all feel about that? Obviously, they're not gonna know your real names, but yeah. Like, but like, I'm just like, oh, my name is Moses. Like, oh, my name is Moses. You know, like <laughs> it's not. It's just a band name, you know. Did y'all have like other names before, or like any ideas? Like, I want to know like the drawing board of like <laughs> that. It's so. I think spoiled. Marmalite, but that's our yeah. song name. Yeah, it was a song name. It's the same I was like, mm, I don't know. But there's just like it just like that one just like yeah. randomly came in your head yeah i was like bert and meg and we live in texas <laughs> <laughs> you go to the fucking bert and meg show yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> and we safe and it's texas it's so, <laughs> you know, we got our guns mm-hmm. <laughs> that's funny as fuck um as far as like where do you see yourselves in five years just as a as a group as a duo like what do you what do y'all five picture yourself like doing in five years bro i'm gonna be what 24 <laughs> so <laughs> in five years I don't know I, don't I cannot know. I'm probably gonna be finishing college I don't know as far as or, like a, a, so you can be finishing college are you are you like so how hard is it to like balance like like, like college like that and dude. like and, damn bad but yeah I need yeah. lucky help on my school shit though Fuck. I need lucky grind on that mm. but it's just bro it's just balance like I just don't know how to balance it bro. yeah that, that's it's everyone me. yeah it's literally up to me we have we have like a, we have a weekly show that we do and we also work full time and we also like have a, our own life shit it's so hard to like balance it yeah. but yeah. like as far as as long as you like set like a, 
a set day to like practice or and like plan ahead with the shows and shit and like balance is good but like, I, i'm pretty bad at it too so <laughs> i get it what about you in five years yeah five years what do you what do you see yourself either you personally or like the band together like what what um, what's the goals here yeah <laughs> you know, you know, about like, it? yeah it's just like bro we're you gotta think about the future guys yeah. like, be a mortuary assistant yeah. <laughs> being a like weird metal band life maybe life goals um, bro okay um so now i'm gonna good, ask but, some hard ass ones you ready oh. may i add that Go ahead. Yeah, go ahead go ahead at least have something done like at least some, have something published mm-hmm. so that yeah. when i'm older i can look back and be like oh i did this when i was 17 i was like i was living the time of my life you know yeah, yeah. so so like the so studio recording is definitely on yeah. the list then. oh probably even it's like a mm-hmm. demo it's like mm-hmm. sitting in your room mm-hmm. oh um, yeah this was me okay. yeah <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, especially like we're in the like age of like the internet, so like everything's yeah. out on public, like it's and it'll never go away. It's like kind of scary to think about, honestly. Yeah, like, like having like because like we have we have like ninety episodes of this shit. Like we're like, and so now like like twenty years like our kids are gonna see like our first episode. There, there's episodes. I think it was like the one of the first ten. I can't remember which one it was, but uh, we talked to our kids. Yeah, and that was I went back and listened to that shit. I was like, oh fuck, I was like, everything be the best wrestler ever. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, all right, that shit was crazy. Yeah, doing dumb shit like that. And I think about that in like in 20 years when you have to show your kids. Mm-hmm. Or I'm dead and like my mom finds that no. shit. No. God forbid. God forbid. God forbid. Yeah. She's like, what the fuck? <laughs> That's crazy. Um, so is there anything you want to say to the Burton Meg supporters and fans and all that? Okay. Or the haters. Or the haters. Or the fucking Bro. ops. <laughs> yeah. If you fuck hate y'all. me, don't, don't, like, don't be like, don't don't come off like I don't know I don't know I, I'm gonna hate the, to the haters about but, it. <laughs> yeah, don't like if you hate me, hate, please like hate me up front at uh, least. Yeah. Don't like lie to me or like if you make don't, it known. Like, yeah, make, make it, it known, bro. Yeah. I'm like okay, but I'm not I'm not wait I'm not with the smoke. Though. I'm not. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, like, let I'm me not know, so I'll stay away from you. Yeah, 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 like, we can talk. We can talk about it. We can talk about it. You hate me, bro. But like other the people that support us, I'm like thank you so much. Yeah. I be thinking about this shit and I want to make it a reality and it's like you, you guys help me. Yeah, 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 y'all fucking you're doing amazing already and like I, the sky's the limit for y'all for real. And I really appreciate y'all coming here. We're not ending yet by the way. Yeah. I just want to say <laughs> I was like, "Damn." No, no, no. <laughs> like, no. What about you? Like what do you want to say to the fans or the haters? You probably want to say a lot to the haters. Love them. Love them. <laughs> DGK. I love Peace, haters. love and happiness. Yeah. <laughs> That's live, love, laugh to those people. Live, love, laugh. I don't, I don't know. I, I like. I know haters, bro. <laughs> I got haters, <laughs> bro. Um, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I, I kind of don't see what people like about us because mm-hmm. we both like talk to each other about like, do we do great? Do we do great? Like, uh, did we sound bad? bad? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. So like, okay. we, we want to know like what we sound like or what people think. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. why we're not recording. You yeah. Because mm-hmm. like you can hear it's like. Yeah, it may sound good in like a live setting, but in the studio, it's something different. Mm, you know, you, yeah. you're like locking in and making sure this, you're putting your money's worth and your time's worth. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. So, well, you, y'all don't think y'all sound good ever? Oh, no, I'm not. Like, I'm like, sometimes I'm like, damn, okay, I did that yeah. feel pretty good. Yeah. You know, I if I hear the recording yeah. back, I'm nah, like, okay. I get it. Think about it. You're not recording music, then you step away, and then you listen to it. You're like, oh, that's the worst fucking shit I've ever fucking done. Yeah. Like, and all of a sudden, you're not in the crowd, so you can't even yeah. you can't even right. hear exactly how it, it's yeah. portraying to them. Yeah. See, that, and I, that's what I'm trying to like. Whenever I, because I, I make music too, and, and like whenever I'm playing shows, and like I feel like I sound like shit every single time, so I completely get like what you're saying. Then I hear like videos, you're like, like footage, Damn, and I'm like, oh, shit. I really did that shit. And yeah. everyone's like, you did great. And I'm like, uh, uh. no, you did great. Yeah. Because like the sound was projected great. towards them, like, like you can't hear anything, like, and you, you just think like you're doing bad, but yeah, and you're just like locked in. <laughs> yeah, 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 locked in. Yeah. What's like, um, can we talk about the worst show y'all played? Oh, mm. that's haters, bro. Is it? I don't, we don't, we don't, I, we don't I, actually, I don't even know. I don't even know. Like, what I is the worst it. show? It wasn't the worst show. I think it was the worst setting, like where it was. Oh, that, no, no, like, no. Gas station. No, it wasn't that bad, bro. I was like, they wanted to it hear us. Bad. All right, then. Oh, Rio? Yeah. It, no. no. Oh, Rio? No. no. It was at this. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I love like the band. I guess it's just like the place. Yeah, the, like it was like it was on the side of a road. Just the bands listening to us. You talking about Rio Market, the gas station? Oh, we were talking. No, it's like it was some like, random place. yeah, I don't even remember, but uh-huh. I remember her name though. Fuck, bro. Name right Fuck. here. It was like a DJ. <laughs> they were all noise. noise yeah, like there was. A, yeah, there was. It was pretty cool. I actually liked it though. Yeah, I was chilling. I was but like, as far right, as like, they want to hear something. You know? 
Yeah. Well, as far as like, um, did y'all play it on that show? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So like, like we just brought our shit and we were just like waiting and we were like, okay. Did y'all sound like extremely different to the other people? Yeah. Yeah. yeah definitely. They probably, what the fuck? <laughs> definitely. Does definitely. that happen often? Um, no, um, I don't think so. We don't know what we sound like. Though. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I want like, a recording, we don't know how to bro. Like, I want a like, recording. Um, Damn. So like, so what's stopping I, y'all from from the studio time? Yeah, besides, I like, mean, like, I mean, dinero. No, yeah, dinero. <laughs> okay. yeah. Like money. I'm, either money or just like I don't know anybody, bro. Mm. So I'm just like, okay. I'm sure. Actually, I, I probably do know somebody. I just don't want to ask. Bro. Yeah, like, yeah. I feel yeah, so yeah, guilty. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, think about it, like. If you have a people that you know that that, that want to record, like say like a, yeah, that, a band, like, like Boss or something, me. yeah, I'm sure they would love to record. I'm sure they would love to record y'all's music. Like it doesn't even have to be like some fancy studio. Like even if it's just like a demo, like we have interfaces here, like we could probably like do that shit. You know what I mean? Like yeah. it, it's it's so accessible. Um, but I feel like a lot of like a bands, um, that it's it's timing and scheduling as well, especially yeah. like four people bands. Like definitely, so like, dude. Yeah. That's why I give props to them, bro. Like five person band is crazy. Like how is it like planning stuff with like y'all two like, he doesn't answer his phone yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> Dude, it's like it's so bad like uh, the communication with me i've uh, i need to fix it actually i need to stop being like no 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 like yeah. just fix it bro yeah you gotta uh, be in the know you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, yeah, you gotta it, be bro. present they, they get on my ass i don't like checking my phone he's horrible i'm over here texting him calling him like all this stuff and he doesn't he like i have to call him Text, talk, text I hate, delete. I hate text because I'm like, I'll, I'll reply in my head and I'll like pre, I might even pre-type it and then I yeah. walk away. And I didn't hit send. <laughs> I have so many texts where I opened it, typed some shit out and didn't hit send. Insane. Yeah. It's fucked. I showed up to a practice without even responding one time. <laughs> There's a couple of times where he comes to my, he used to come to my house like really like early wouldn't text me that he's on the way like, and i'll be like at golden chick my shit was, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, my shit was like, at her crib bro i was like i'm trying to play i'm trying to play i'm ready she's grubbing yeah <laughs> that's funny as hell well, I, well cool, kudos to y'all for still making it work even though you don't answer your phone that's good yeah. <laughs> um yeah so I'll, that's what i'm saying like i'm that's cool that y'all like it's just two people like you don't have to worry about four other people's like scheduling and mm-hmm. stuff like that and i give mad props to people that that do like are in a big ass band like that because yeah and I, they, it's hard to do that they live their lives you know yeah. they live their lives after this this is like a thing they do on the side you know mm-hmm. but as as a as a long term well, goal is this least, <laughs> yeah you don't know yeah, i don't want to it's probably somebody's biggest passion you know yeah exactly so as far as far as um like musically goes like do, do y'all see yourselves like like getting like track like good traction numbers stuff like that is that like a goal for y'all is it like, like more like a passion like y'all are doing this shit for real for real right I mean, if it goes that way, it goes yeah. that way, you know? Like, you know. I don't know. I, definitely think, I definitely think y'all should. Yeah, yeah. That's what people, I'm trying to tell you. I like it that much. You that shit's know? great. That's just how it works. So, yeah. lastly, um, we I said, like, goals for the next five years. Like, so, like, what do you, so, you have the studio recordings eventually, right? Mm-hmm. And so, just, like, are just, like, more concerned about just playing more shows and getting out there more? Or, Probably. like, what, what's, like, what's, like, your main, like, focus right now as far as the band? Make something, like different make mm-hmm. something different because i feel like we're learning our songs we've been playing them for a while we yeah. like, gotta make, make more stuff and like more like harder and, mm-hmm. you know constantly uh, yeah, make shit better yeah, yeah evolving evolve. yeah you know, yeah like grow do you want to like change genres or like switch like sound a little bit or he does yeah, yeah. i don't care <laughs> genre jumping like, doing crazy shit i don't know i yeah. don't know what our sound is but i like try to stick to it when making like new songs mm-hmm. um yeah. but he likes playing more like chugging shit. Oh, okay. Dude, I'm like really into like technical guitar, oh, bro. Ah. Like fucking, like, what's it called? Like, what is it? Like, prog metal, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, that shit is crazy. Yeah. Like, just cool. being able to, and like, what's it called? Like, flamenco guitar. And how they can just like pluck so fast without yeah. even faster than the picks. Like, nah, you're just. So different. you're just trying to yeah. venture, venture out like instrument wise and just like try like new shit? Yeah. Just put like more in the center. Like, more in the sense of hardcore, like yeah, 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 evolve that and try to think of oh shit, new sounds. Yeah, yeah. Um, do you have like any other like like side projects you'd want to do, like as far as like di- a different genre completely, like not even like band wise, or even just any Shoot other games? interest, any any other interest like photography, like any other art shit, whatever. Like yeah, what do y'all do? Like yeah. what do y'all like? What are your other interests? I feel like we didn't even talk about that. <laughs> yeah. Do you have two? Me first. You have two. Uh, um. You, you go first. All right. What's it called? I'm really into videography. Like, I want to like, 
make music videos, but like oh yeah, old school music. Like I have this old camera, and I'm just like, okay, I want to just do it with that camera only. You mm-hmm. know, I'm not gonna upgrade no nothing because they say I'm gonna come up from nothing. Yeah, you know? <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh well, that's but real. Like, still, like I want to make music videos, and then, I don't know, just be more out there and be more in the in the scene. Yeah, in the scene, but like more like into like the technical aspects of like like making music uh, like, yeah like uh-huh. recording like being in like a sound engineer or something like that i'm really interested in that and i don't know it's being that guy you go to you know yeah, <laughs> yeah. Being, like being yeah. well versed that's mm-hmm. that's what knowing a lot Ma- of things, master yeah. of all trades yeah. Yeah. yeah or jack of all trades master of all of them. <laughs> yeah. yeah i went to skating yeah <laughs> yeah so yeah that's uh, what's up that's good that's good to have like hobbies outside of it because like if this like if, for example like the podcast if this is our only hobby i'd fucking kill myself yeah <laughs> yeah. yeah you got it's good it's good to like like pick your brain on other things that's not like music and mm-hmm. stuff like that because if you just focus on that alone only like you'd you'd probably hate it yeah that's what i feel at least but what about you as far as interest wise uh i'm really into art uh, i do stippling like black and white shit mm-hmm. um post it and then uh <laughs> uh, just listening on music, finding new music, uh, and bouldering. Oh, the climbing! Yeah. Oh hell yeah! Sick. I suck Zach at it. Shit. Oh. Oh. Zach loves that shit. I'm fucking terrified of heights. I'm ter- yeah, I'm scared of heights. Couldn't do it. I Hiking's fun. Pops, but- fuck. Them people strong as hell. Hell yeah. Oh, no. like, do you like go to like gyms and stuff like that? Like yeah. Gyms? You go to ADP. Mm-hmm. ADP is that shit. I love it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. I, I, I saw a video of you climbing. Like, holy shit! I didn't know you could do that. <laughs> Zach, get down from there. Get down from there. Get down this instant. Really? Yeah. Like, I, it's hard to keep up. Do you ever like go like the the, the free the free one like on like green belt and stuff? Have you ever done that? Like climbing up? Oh yeah, that shit oh, looks solo terrifying. Climb? Yeah. I have not done. Well, I tried like on little things whenever I'm in parks, but like that shit hurts without my chalk so oh yeah. yeah i don't understand how that fucking works because like is it like it just dries your hands out is it to like grip more like, yeah I, it's like, I don't like the way that feels it makes me uneasy yeah yeah Ugh, fucking oh that drives me insane it's like nail on a chalkboard but like, like oh, can man. we put moisturizer on our hands yeah, <laughs> like, i hate dry hands i hate that yeah shit. It, it, it eventually just feels like you, 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 you get used to it oh, yeah really? yeah but it takes like a minute oh fuck oh, yeah I, we had a hiking phase and like so, like we haven't done. What you mean? Shit. It just it just got cold. We're going back. Yeah. What the fuck you mean? No, it got too hot, no. and then it got cold again. I like the hot shit. That shit fun. Hell no, that, that shit, shit hurts. Yeah, yeah. yeah that like, shit's no. fun. I like hiking. Actually, being cold, being in the cold is way, way better. Yeah. No, Wait, like, I think it's better. Think it's better. I, I would have rather. I would have rather hiked in the cold. Me and Zach love wearing oh, jackets. Look, he die, bro. It's easier. Nah, it's easier, it's easier to cold, bro. It's easier to cool down on a hot day than it is to warm up on a cold day. <laughs> Not but for it, real, bro. Wear a fucking face mask. Yeah. Like Come if you on, like, if you, like say you missed the bus like, <laughs> that, like what's it called like January and like because it only gets here like cold here around like January January February, February that's mm-hmm. it yeah and then like say it's like super cold, bro you're you're, you're fried bro yeah. you're so like fried if it's if it's summer bro mm. you're chilling go under a tree <laughs> and you'll be a hey <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm also not trying to have a heat stroke yeah for real I that's, yeah, I that's, do oh yeah that's, that's kind of valid. <laughs> <That's about laughs> <laughs> Like 10 a.m., like 10 to 2, you're, you're straight golden. <laughs> you're, you're not sweating. Yeah. yeah. Like the sun's like out. Kind of a breeze. We found that yeah. sweet spot for real, though. That yeah. shit was crazy. I'm so envious of like other states that have like way better weather than we do. Fuck. Like they yeah. actually have four seasons. Like I haven't had a, we haven't had a four seasons in like since I was like two years old. Mm-hmm. Like, <laughs> like I, have, I don't know what a regular like cycle is. Like yeah. I'm so jealous of like Washington and like all those like cool like. Places where it rains a lot and it's like nice and gloomy and shit. We just, all we have is hot and freezing either boat, either bush, either bush where you cold. go, you're gonna die. It's too hot, too cold. Yeah. It fucking snows and you're fucking dying of a heat stroke. It's Texas. so bad. <laughs> That's Texas. That's Texas. Mm-hmm. That's, That's Burton Texas Meg. That's Texas for you. Uh, <laughs> fucking, like, what's it called? Like, Georgia, Atlanta. Like, the, have you seen this fall there? No, mm. all the trees like, nice turn, yeah it's so yeah. beautiful Fuck. and it's like still cold outside mm-hmm. it's like nice i want to know what a nice spring spring yeah. is yeah <laughs> because i feel like we haven't had that the forever. minute it turns spring it's like fucking the heat's up bro 80, yeah. yeah nine degrees like what the south by's gonna be rough this year dog <laughs> yeah south by's gonna be crazy Bronx have you ever been no no really I, nah. my 
uh, English teacher talks to me about it. Oh, really? He's always asking me. He's like, so how's your metal band going? You played at Mohawk yet? I was like, oh. And he's like talking about South by. I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> he want, he like trying to recommend us to playing there. Or mm. I don't know. Mohawk's a venue to yeah, do Mohawk's it at, though. Good, dude. It's a fucking great venue. Well, yeah. once I got kicked out of Mohawk. Bro. Oh fuck! Really? Yes, bro. I got oh, kicked out. I'm not gonna go into detail about it, but uh, hey, it's bro, yeah. literally, bro, this man like picked me up on my jacket. Get out, of, dude! Get out of here. I was like, I was like, bro, get off me, bro. Yeah. I get out, but like, get off me, bro. And I just like pushed. Rammed you by your shirt collar? Yes, bro. I was like, I'm not, I'm not a little little boy. Bro. Yeah. I'm not a little boy like that, bro. That's me. That's dehumanizing. Yeah. Really. I feel like when people get kicked out of places, they're like, how could I catch this person off guard as fuck and try to pull this person? the fuck out of the club yeah they made it seem so, so bad bro they made it seem so bad like motherfuckers were it was bad what are you talking but like but not to kick you out literally bro motherfuckers yeah, are you were with killing, me but like bro they were there were some big ass motherfuckers crowd killing uh-huh i'm a little ass boy he's good you're good get you need to get the fuck yeah. out of here yeah, yeah. I'm like, bro, I'm a little you just punch that girl in the fucking face it's fine but you gotta go <laughs> yeah that's so fucked up yeah <laughs> Damn, I would love to hear it on a Mohawk stage though. That shit would sound crazy. It was when the, it was on a Scorch show. Yeah. Oh, was that recently? Yeah. Oh, I was there. Yeah. He, he damn. Got was, that really, was that Free Week? Yeah. Oh yeah, damn, that's funny. I was there. Damn. Fuck. I would if I would have known it, I would have stopped it. Yeah, hey, right. he's with me. <laughs> Leave him alone. I tried like, getting him back in. Nah, hey, Thor said I would have stopped this. Like Mark, Wal- <laughs> Mark Wahlberg, 9/11. <laughs> Thor would have stopped it. Did y'all hear about that? No. Mark Wahlberg. Okay, sorry. This is gonna be Bro, crazy. Wow, sorry, guys. Like, uh, Mark Wahlberg. Uh, he like made this crazy claim that he said if he was on the plane on 9/11 that he could have done something to this stuff. He's like, it wouldn't happen. <laughs> Mark Wahlberg said <laughs> things would have gone a lot different if I was on there. Like, yeah. Okay, Did he, like, Marky miss Mark. Miss it though. Like he was right next to like he was at the. That's what, at the airport. There's a they, lot of people that say right? that shit. Like, ah, fucking. Um, fuck, who the fuck was it? Seth. Oh, Seth, Seth MacFarlane. Seth MacFarlane <laughs> said, like, oh, I was supposed to be on that plane. But so many people say they're like, how can you yeah. prove it? Prove it. Show us. Are you at this? Yeah. Are you in New York? I think. Yeah. yeah. Fact checking false claim in 9 11 victims. Really Michael Jackson, Mark Wahlberg. Michael Jackson. They said that he had a meeting in bro. the fucking World Trade Center. They were like, Michael wait, let's move it. Or he was bro. running late or some shit. Bro. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, I don't believe it. Oh. That's crazy work for real. <laughs> they said George Washington had a meeting on top of there the morning of, but he didn't make it. <laughs> George Washington. <laughs> probably, probably just lying. Probably yeah. just lying. Like, like man, I would make it about them. Like, I would have been on there. Yeah. I definitely should have been. And Mark Wahlberg was like, y'all would have been there. Motherfucker, I would have stopped it. Bro, you would have got your ass shot. <laughs> no, nah, for real. That's Mark, just wild. Mark Wahlberg stops you from getting kicked out of the Mohawk. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, you. Hey. Thank you, Marky Mark. You're, real stand- You're the stand- best. Guy. Thanks, man. That's funny as fuck. Hey, well, any last words y'all got for last words for this episode here? I mean, I think we're doing. I think it was a fucking great. Y'all did great, by the way. Yeah. Y'all, y'all started off a little nervous, but <laughs> <laughs> y'all loosened up. No. Oh. Bro, appreciate the love. Bro. Of course. The love. Thank you for having us. Yeah. Of course, yes. of course. Um, shout out to Bird Meg fans. Yep. Fuck the Bird Meg haters. Y'all chill. Yeah. Y'all suck. Fuck the ops. <laughs> Uh, if y'all have a problem, be with nice. It, come to us. We'll we'll handle it. Um, but I'm really excited for y'all's future. And yeah. I'm really excited to um, go to more shows. Um, y'all are a fucking amazing band. Yeah, for real. Um, this has been another episode of the Artist Hour. Uh, this is Burton Meg, and we're signing off. So we'll see y'all later. Love you, Luis. Uh, bye bye. Shout out, Luis. Shout out, Marshall. Bye bye. That was awesome. Shout out, mom. Shout out. All <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my shout outs, right? I didn't do my shout outs. You didn't do shout outs. You can do it right now. Go ahead. Right now. Go ahead. All right. Cut scene. Shout out my mom. Shout out, shout out everybody. Shout out, every, shout out Zoe. Shout out Zoe. Shout, shout out, out Zoe. Zoe. Shout out Zoe. Zoe. Shout out Zoe. Literally. Um, yeah. What about you? Shout outs. While we're here. <laughs> shout out mom. Shout out mom. Yeah. Cool. Bye bye. See y'all later. <laughs>